Okay, everybody, uh, welcome to West Potomac Park. We are down by the Jefferson Memorial to take photos of my newest helmet. Actually, it's not new, it's I've had it for quite a while. I just never had a chance to take photos of it till now. But anyway, I thought I'd take photos of it here at West Potomac Park. Here by the Jefferson Memorial, a lot of low hanging trees here. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, low hanging branches. Uh, uh. Anyway, I don't see any place here I can take photo unless we go to the Jefferson Memorial itself back there. So, uh, let's see. All right, everyone, here we are at the Jefferson Memorial, as you can see. That's the Jefferson Memorial right there. Tribute to uh, Jefferson, one of our founding fathers. And this is the Tidal Basin on the right. The Tidal Basin, across the Tidal Basin, of course, is the Lincoln Memorial. Another memorial to another founding fund. I'm trying to find a place to uh, take some photos. Oh, the Jefferson Memorial is open again. They're doing some construction work here over by the side. I don't know what they're doing, but anyway. I don't know what they're doing by the uh, Jefferson Memorial, Thomas Jefferson Memorial. I don't think I can take my scooter up there, so I'll just stay down here. We'll see. The sun is in the other... The sun is in the wrong position again, just like before. It's pretty typical of this time of day. It's lunchtime. So the sun is like straight up ahead, up, and up in the sky. Uh, this is the back, the rear area of the Jefferson Memorial. So if you can look inside, you can see the the statue of Thomas Jefferson is facing the other way. But the sun is pretty good over here. I'm trying to think if I should take photos over here on this side. Uh, oh. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we, there it is. This is my Washington Redskins Riddell Speedflex helmet here by the Jefferson Memorial. There's a Jefferson Memorial right there. And this is the Ohio Street Bridge. The, that's Ohio Street right there, leads right back into DC actually we're still in DC anyway so here it is my great creation it's a Riddell Speedflex Washington Redskins helmet although the lighting is not very good over here anyway let's see if I can take some more pictures over here and see how it turns out they're very close to the airport as you can see there's a plane going out or actually it's coming in from somewhere look at this shot huh isn't that a nice shot we got the Redskins helmet right in the middle we got the Jefferson Memorial over here and we got the Lincoln Memorial over there isn't that cool what if we turn the helmet this way that's an even cooler shot problem is the Sun is kind of shining from this direction and it's putting this whole side of the helmet in the shadow so I gotta find somewhere else where the sun is, uh, where the sun is right. Maybe over there on that side. I think the sun is coming down on this side. We'll see. Uh, okay. Well, uh, we are on the uh, we are on the Ohio Street Bridge. Everybody, this leads right to Ohio Street over there. And as you can see, the uh, Jefferson Memorial right there. I think the Back here, we have the. Uh, that's Virginia on the other side. See? And uh, this is the Tidal Basin. That's the uh, 14, 14th Street Bridge. And uh, okay, uh, let me see if I can find some other place to take photos of this helmet. Maybe over on that side where we were before. Seems like the sun is better over there. Now this is a better shot right here. You see that? No people around, the sun in the right direction, the Jefferson Memorial, I'll be at the back, right in the background. Oh, that's perfect. Look at that. That's perfect. Isn't that a perfect shot? Yeah, dude. Yeah, so this is a nice shot right here. It was staring at me right in the face. The helmet, Jefferson Memorial in the background. This is where I'm going to do my photo shoot. And there's a plane passing by again. Plane coming into land at National Airport.
All right, let's go down to let's go down to the hill or up to the hill to see if there's another place there I can take photos. As you can see, the scooter is going pretty slow because we're going uphill. Although you can't tell we're going uphill, but we are going uphill as you can see. We are going uphill even though I'm got at full power. We are going slow and now we're leveling off as you can see. There we go. We are going to be passing by the Department of Agriculture on the right. I remember I used to take classes over at the Department of Agriculture. Because besides being a government agency, they are also a school and they offer courses in oh oh shit oh shit oh in many different things like uh, uh, IT and art and all that. Uh, oh man, oh, 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 oh boy. Rough road, rough road. All right, welcome to the mall, everyone. This is the National Mall. It's the large area in between the Lincoln Memorial and uh, the Capitol building straight up ahead. I think I'll be going down to the... Uh, oh, riding on gravel is not very comfortable. It's also very shaky. But let's go down to the National Museum of the Indian American. I'm not sure if it's open or not. It might be closed. I think it's better if it's closed. That way nobody will bother me while I'm taking my photos. Oh, oh, rough ride. Anyway, uh, we're almost to the National Museum of the Indian American right now. And I can feel my spleen being rocked right now. The next scooter I buy should have better suspension than this. You know, like nice suspension. This has a solid suspension, which I don't like. But I wanted a scooter, so I bought the scooter. Here it is, let's go. This is the National Gallery of Art, everybody. And across the way, that's the Air and Space Museum over there, which is being renovated right now. And it's gonna be renovated, it's gonna be closed for the next few months. And they're promising brand new exhibits and brand new things that uh, you've never seen before. So I'm looking forward to when the uh, Air and Space Museum opens. But anyway, let's go down to the Lincoln Memorial to see what's going on down there. And if there's anything cool going on down there. This here is the sculpture garden to my right. You can go in there and see some uh, nice sculptures, both modern and uh, actually mostly modern sculptures at the Sculpture Garden, which is also part of the Smithsonian Museum. As we traverse between the car and the bus, parking is a premium around here, so if you see anybody par uh, leaving their parking spot, you can bet that there will be somebody swooping in to grab that parking spot. This is the Museum of Natural History. This is where you will see animals like elephants and snakes and prehistoric uh, things like that. Pretty interesting if you're a natural history buff. Right here at the Museum of Natural History. This is the Museum of American History. Here you will see artifacts uh, about the history of America, dating back to the Revolutionary War and uh, all the history of America. Uh, let's go to the Lincoln Memorial as we pass by the, uh, the Washington Monument behind me. If you notice, the Washington Monument has two color stones. As you go up higher, the stones are colored a little bit uh, darker or lighter. <laughs> That's because uh, when they started building the Lincoln Memorial, they came from a, a certain quarry. But then the Civil War happened and the construction was halted for about 30 years. And when construction started again, the quarry where they originally got the stone from all the stone was gone, so they had to go to a different quarry. And that's why the Lincoln Memorial is two... I mean, the Washington Monument is two different colors. All right, we are once again approaching the Lincoln 
Memorial. I don't see anything going on today, just rather just a rather regular day here at the Lincoln Memorial. Sometimes there are things going on, I don't know, like special ceremonies or last week there was a uh, filming going on, they were filming a movie here. But it looks like today is just a regular day. Just a lot of tourists and uh, looking around here by the reflecting pool in between the Lincoln Memorial and the Washington Monument. Okay, the Washington Monument is behind me and I am approaching the Lincoln Memorial right up ahead. On this bright sunny day, partly sunny day, partly cloudy, temperature is about 89, 89 degrees. It's uh, not that hot. It's not as hot as it was last week. Last week was pretty hot. This week is not too bad. Highs in the 80s, you know, sunny. So you better enjoy it now because in a few months, it won't be hot. Let's just put it that way. One hour later. All right, I'm just going to the post office now. That's all I'm gonna do. I'm already done with my photo, so now, now I'm just going to the post office and drop off some mail. Oh, I can stay on the uh, scooter long enough. It's Friday, so it's a little quiet. Not too many people today. Here's the post office now. All right, let's drop off the mail here at the post office. Leave the scooter outside. This post office kind of, oh, it's a little bit cleaner than usual today. Usually this post office is pretty messy. So let's just drop off the mail here. And uh, we'll be good to go. Okay, mail dropped off. I don't know where I'm gonna go now. After I drop off the mail. I don't know. You know what? Let's check and see what's going on at the White House today. It's getting pretty cloudy. I hope it doesn't rain. I checked the weather report and it said it was just gonna be cloudy. But let's go over to the White House and see what's going on at the White House. Alright, welcome to the White House everybody. This is the Dwight D. Eisenhower Executive Office Building here on the right side. And uh, right next to it, of course, is the White House. And as you can see, there's uh, quite a number of people here today, as you can see. There are no, not too many protesting going on. Also, not too many uh, street performers today, which is kind of, not that I've gotten used to them performing here. Actually, I spoke too soon. Here's some street performers right here. As you can see. I don't know what they're doing. They're just dancing or... There's the White House, everybody. On the right side is the White House. Let's go to Lafayette Square here, Lafayette Park. And I will show you a place that has been in the news lately. Here in Lafayette Square, Lafayette Park. Oh. It has been in the news lately. So let's go this way. Lafayette Square, Lafayette Park was named after General uh, Lafayette of the French army who helped us win the Revolutionary War. And in the middle of Lafayette Park, as you can see, is a statue of Andrew Jackson which was recently power washed you know what I'm saying it was power washed lately I think it was just rest yesterday it was power washed anyway here we have oh, here we have the White House everybody and here we have the tree ah. This is the tree that was hit by lightning a couple weeks ago and uh, unfortunately 
three people died. There was a big uh, lightning storm here a few weeks ago and they four people took uh, umbrage under this tree over here and unfortunately that was the wrong thing to do and they were hit by lightning two of them died immediately and one of them died a day later when one of them survived to tell her story anyway this is the tree where it happened i don't know if this tree is still alive or what are they, what they're gonna do with this tree or what i don't know anyway this is the tree as you can see a lot of memorials on the tree for the people who died here and uh it's right here at lafayette square right next to the white house there's the white house everybody uh this is where you can buy all kinds of maga stuff let's go brandon yeah so if you want to come to dc and buy a lot of maga trump stuff this is where you buy it i think i'll buy something what do you want a let's go brandon hat well i think uh I don't have uh, anywhere else to go and my my scooter is dying so I might as well just uh, go back to where I came from just somewhere over here just try to avoid the uh, that's the White House behind me everybody and this is the United States Courthouse over here I used to have lunch here at the courtyard in there. I don't anymore since they closed it. So, so, uh, but it looks like it's open again. Maybe I'll uh, come back and uh, do it again. Anyway, let's let's go back while I try to maneuver down here. Let's see if we can go down 16th Street down here. Might be easier that way as it's just uh, just uh, it's against against the traffic and there's also a lot of uh, this street is pretty rough you see how rough it is uh, uh, uh. well I guess that's about it for this vlog uh, I hope you liked it if you liked it then please go ahead and click the like button uh, down below and if you liked it enough to subscribe then by all means please do subscribe so that's it for this vlog until next week i will say